Hello and welcome back to MLG Anaheim. My name is Benson. I'm down on the floor with Matt Shadows. How are you doing, Matt? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm pretty good. Thanks very much. Is, is this your first MLG Anaheim? It is. It is. I've actually watched all the events uh, on the stream, but this is the first one to attend. Hey, that's pretty cool. How are you finding it? You're finding it pretty exciting. There's lots of people here. That's amazing. It's great, man. You're actually uh, playing at the event as well, I was told. And uh, I have an interesting fact, okay? Now, this is pretty interesting. You may have seen on the stream earlier on, we have MLG Puckett, you know, his top fails. Now, I was told how you were actually eliminated from the tournament, which was a little bit of a fail that happened from your teammate with a lightning. Yeah, you know what, you know what I'm talking about. Do you want to just explain to the stream exactly what happened in your last game? Oh, well, a teammate of ours uh, thought there was a gun battle going on. He used a hailstorm and killed the whole team. And uh, the flag was left there, and we ended up losing with five seconds left. Not, not the best way to go out, but still, <laughs> not, it, it was good. I don't, good want, I don't want to throw him under the bus, though. It's okay. We were just here for fun. So not naming names. Not, not naming names. Yeah, it's okay. Well, an interesting fact as well is you actually have a character in the Call of Duty Black Ops 2 game based on yourself. That must be pretty cool. I mean, how do you feel about that? That oh, was amazing. It's our favorite game, uh, the Black Ops series. Just everything Treyarch's done, it's our favorite game. So uh, it was a complete honor to be in Black Ops 2. That's awesome. All right. Well, thank you very much for joining us down here. Now, throw it back up to the booth. And it is That's so my boy, awesome. Matt Shadows, man. Matt That's Shadows boy. here in MLG. Yeah. I think they finished 49th in the open bracket yeah, out of 128 teams. I play with him. He, like, he's legit. Like, the boy can play Call of Duty, That's man. That's awesome. Yeah, and I bet he probably would have done a lot better without that lightning strike or whatever that happened at the end. I didn't he's, recognize him with the long hair, though. I, oh, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> I've seen why. He, he plays lead play all the time. The first time I met him, he was talking about how he watched MLG streams. like back, That's sick. Black Ops 1 and stuff. You know, it was naming all these teams. I was just floored to, to have him. So I, I, I love that he supports Call of Duty and everything we're doing here, and I'm glad he got to come out and play. It's awesome. Super great to have him here, and it looks like, guys, our players are ready for his Let's we are it. heading to game number two. Any second, Express Search and Destroy. Yeah. We saw nothing but B rushes from Impact on this map earlier. Do you think they're going to have to mix it up against Complexity, or are both teams just going to constantly rush each other in the terminal like we've seen so far this week? Yeah, so you've got Parasite. Look, Parasite's talented with the sniper. Clayster is also incredibly lethal with the sniper rifle. So these terminal pushes on Express can get very interesting. Uh, it's going to be hard to say. They're going to have to switch up a lot. These two teams clearly very talented, and we'll have to take it one round at a time to try to throw off the opponent. So, and we got some serious snipers in this oh, game, too. Oh, that's what I'm too. saying. Oh, actually, I, I, I would be remiss to say it's just Parasite and Clayster. All of these boys can Miracles, do work with the boomstick, man. Karma. Yeah. I mean, they're all good. They're Eggs all good is going to be pulling yeah. out the scope every once in a while. I can't wait to get this one going. Remember, if you're just joining us, we are in the winner's bracket finals here at the MLG Spring Championships. Both of these teams went undefeated through the winner's bracket. One of them will advance to the championship match. The other will fall to the loser's bracket finals to face off against Optic Gaming. It's about to kick off with game number two and hashtag who do you want to win and who do you think is going to take this one? We got hashtag complexity and hashtag icons impact. Let's get it trending worldwide once again. One of them most certainly will, no doubt about it. And Offensive side of things is going to go to complexity to kick it off. Impact will be on defense, so I think we just got to jump on board with who do you think, Clayster? Yeah, we got yeah, to see some snipers. Got the Here yep. we go. We head to the train yard. It's Express, of course, in search and destroy. We play the best of eleven. The first to win six rounds. You're going to take turns on offense and defense. There's the two bomb sites, the A bomb site over near the control tower, the B bomb site. It's going to be within the terminal. Five seconds to plant the bomb. Seven and a half to get the defuse. And early on, Clayster's pulling out the boomstick. I love it, man. Let's see what he can do with it. And again, we were just talking about this, the terminal action. What's going to happen here? Crimson pulls up a kill on Miracles with a nade, and Karma takes out oh. Aix, making it an early 3v3 situation. TP does have the bomb for Complexity. And with that play, we have Complexity with total control of the B bomb site. Impact starting to stack up top here inside the walkway. Is Killa going to get brave enough to charge in with the shotgun? We're going to see if he waits <laughs> for his like teammates or he's going to be a hero. And here he is. If he's going to push in, he does Whoa. see somebody, so he is going to backpedal a little bit, see if Killa can draw him out with the shotgun. And now shots fired. He knows things are 
just going on crazy. TP picks up a kill and Karma takes out Crim6. 2v2 situation. TP and Clays are up going against Killa and Karma. All right, so each team lost a player, but I have to say this was a win for Impact. They done. forced the Bomb Planner to back up. Now Complexity doesn't have many options. They need to either sprint directly to A or oh, they need oh, to push oh. back into B. That was a big kill from TP, though, and now it's all up to Killa. Let's see what he can do. The last man standing in a one-on-two oh. makes it a one-on-one, -on -one, and he just has to stop this bomb from being planted for 12 more seconds. Oh my gosh, and now they're just going to chase after him because... And there oh, it is! TP picks TP. it up! Woo! Killa not happy about that one. Killa, how did it happen? We'll show you, Perplex, buddy. Dude. TP pulling out the B23R with so much confidence. Shotgun! And oh. TP, he hit him with the M8 shot before that battle. Killa, I don't know, man. That buckshot, man, wasn't close enough. And Killa is not happy about that, but Complexity will take it as they go up 1-0 and win their offensive-sided round. So now Impact's got to do the same. We're on board with Karma. And Blizz at the start, it looks like Impact trying to employ the exact same strategy we saw from Complexity the round before. Everyone pushing into B. Karma's gonna spot a player, bottom terminal, calls that out, and now he's pushing forward. The shots go down at the front, Aix is gonna win that battle, and Aix now go for a second, has a third kill oh available as well, Miracles goes down, so down goes kill Aix the captain warding it up, and there we go! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Look at them, fired up! Aix just went on a roll, and then Clayster cleaned it up. Your round ending kill cam complexity up 2-0, making impact look human Watch after all. Sides. Oh my goodness, impact has not gone down two games at all this year. They've only dropped four, now five after that first loss to complexity. Let's see what they can do on defense. I'm starting it off with Karma. I'm expecting him to be the player to catch fire for this Impact squad. He is the one who's been giving them all the momentum in the previous matches. Unfortunately though, his teammate Kula is the only one in position to stop that bomb from pushing to A. And now Karma's gonna have to rotate. Spot takes up top, misses just wide left, and the bomb's already being planted. Let's see if Impact can fight back. They're down with one man, four on three situation in favor of Complexity. Yeah, this Bomb is tough is for them. Bomb is down, so Impact's gonna have to move to make something happen here. Parasite does take out Clayster, so it is a 3v3 situation, evening it up, but the Bomb is down, making it even more difficult for these guys to move in here. 31 seconds left on the clock, and they've gotta make some moves. Karma's getting brave. He's taken down, though, by Krim6. And Parasite was able to spot Krim up top. Also going to pick off Aix down low. Miracle is unfortunately losing his one-on-one -on -one battle to TP. So it's going to be Parasite versus two. And TP, TP getting fired up. Clayster's so excited, he's punching his captain in the head with his elbow. <laughs> Yeah, geez, you gotta watch out, Clayster. You don't want to knock one of those players out. Woo! This complexity <laughs> team is just fired up, and they are on a tear oh, now. 3-0 lead over Impact, and this is the look first at, time. Look at that parasite you, face. I have never seen Impact so demoralized as they look right now. At the start here, guys, we're gonna show you the stats. The TP is five and zero. Yeah. Aix, three and two. Crim six, three and two. On the other side, they're keeping Miracles killless once again. That's an uh, incredible role there, and, and really it's Karma that's trying to contribute it for this, this team so much. You know, Miracles has just been struggling on both games so far. They really need him to step up if Impact's going to get back into this game. All right, Krim6 is trying to get sneaky here on the flank. Meanwhile, Parasite and the rest of Impact working their way to the control tower. Early shots being called out. That's going to bait a player straight into Parasite. Aix challenges and wins the battle. Krim6 now coming up behind Karma wow. is going to answer back. It's going to be a two-on-three situation. Make it a two-on-two -two after that kill. Killa is going to take out another one, and it's all up to Clayster for complexity. Oh. And there we go. Killa starting to heat up here in SND. Yeah, now, you know, you got to be a little scared because when Killa does kind of, you know, catch a spark like that, he gets crazy. I mean, look, and he just destroyed Clayster here, put some good shots down the, uh, the train and took care of business. So Killa got to take him out now because he's, he's in the zone. He's look at that zone. face, man. Fierce, man. Fierce. Oh, he is just bouncing with energy and anger right now. We're going to jump on board with him. He is definitely the most vocal player on this squad. He screams with every kill, gets his team fired up, and they need a momentum shift because so far, 
complexity has been dominating this best of five series. And we're on board with Killa here. He's got the shotgun out, trying to do some work with that. He did spot a player here. That's going to help him out. Takes out Aches, looking around for another one. Sees him, takes yeah, him buddy. out. That's Clayster. And Last Impact man standing. Coming Grim six, and it's Killa. Oh, no, oh, oh. Grim gets one. He's getting chased out, and Karma is going to seal the deal. Two straight rounds for Impact as they answer back. Uh oh, it looks like the Giant might be starting to wake up here in Impact. You're starting to see the team that has won the world championship in Call of Duty. That's kind of the performance that we're expecting out of them now. Huge play time. right there. These guys have banked over $430,000 around the world playing Call of Duty Eliminate just in 2013. Trying to add 20,000 more dollars to that prize purse with a here, a win here in MLG Spring Championships. And we got Karma on your screen, but Really, I think the player to watch right now is Killa. He's playing with so much momentum. He's put away that Remington in favor of the MSMC, and I think they're definitely going to be attacking this A-bomb site if Killa is able to get the first pick. Jeez, a half million dollars in seven months from Call of Duty. Must be nice as we stick on board with Killa here, see what they're going to do. Slowing it down a little bit. They've been playing so fast, so aggressive. They're trying to get complexity out to make a mistake before they move in here and get a bomb plant down at A. Somebody is covering on the B side for complexity, so they don't have to worry about backtracking there so nice setup by both teams just want to know who's going to make the first move kill is that player and he's going to be picked off by tp huge stop anytime you can take kill off the board it's a game changer for the entire round the karma so you got to watch out for him miracle is going to get another big kill here for impact and that is going to be one oh make it two down now for impact Three on two situation in favor of Complexity once again. Karma's going to make it a two on oh two. My Karma gosh. goes down and it's a one on one between Miracles and Clayster. That was a huge, huge stop by the MVP there of so many games. And now Miracles is going to get the bomb down. Clayster knows this and is going to have to try to find him and sniff him out here with the bomb down at A. 3-2 in favor of Complexity. Impact trying to tie it up with a round win here. And there oh, it is. Oh, it's there Clay. It is. Clay going to get the defuse, no problem at all. And stopping Impact, they were on a little bit of a roll there. Had the momentum going. Charges and Complexity able to stop that, go up 4-2 in the search and destroy. All right, the there you see in the upper right-hand corner, that is Mr. Eggs. Got to be proud of Clayster with this play. Miracles, you can see the frustration in his face. Oh, didn't even see him, too. That's a, just a... That's, a tough That's the one. worst way to yeah, lose. Yeah, that is the worst way to lose. I mean, so it's close just to miss him like that and get taken out, but it is what it is, and complexity's up 4-2. All right, here we go with round number seven, impacts on defense. Let's jump on board with the attacking squad. I got TP with the bomb, and remember, TP opened this one up 5-0. and oh. He's now at 6-3, and three, slowing down a little bit, and you see that kill column for impact. Killa and Karma really heating it up at 6-2 and two each. And as we're on board Excuse with, yeah, no worries, on board with TP here. Seeing he is the bomb carry. They're going to look at that A bomb site yet again. Nobody's really done. Early on, we saw some quick B pushes. That hasn't happened again. And now TP waiting slowly. Aix is going to come up here to support him. And they're just getting set up to engage the A bomb site. Kill is in some action. Karim Six winning again. the one on one. There's about to be a battle in the middle of the train. And that is going to be Aix going down. We go back to Karim Six, who is protecting TP here at A. Also, I want to show you the location of Miracles, who is. Pulling out the sniper back at the bridge. And not only that, you got Parasite on the middle train tracks. And Karma is backing oh, up Miracles with a second sniper from above. Yeah, in, in all of the impacts, you had Karma, both of these guys were at B. They're actually that starting to go back set. there because it took so long to get that A plant down. It kind of confused them. So Complexity took advantage of that opportunity, gets the bomb down at A, and now Impact has to backpedal towards this A bomb site from B. Parasite trying to get an angle is going to be pushed back. Karma and Miracles getting in the action. Karma's going to get the kill on Clayster. Now jumping in the train as he's going to have his teammates right behind him. Miracles goes down at A. It's going to be up to Parasite and Karma. Crim 6 oh, makes it. Oh, Karma oh, and Crim 6. Oh, boy, Crim 6. Was that the ace? Well, I don't know if it was an ace, but it was pretty close. And he certainly just made things happen here. Oh, my goodness. Look Big at that. They just, try, they just tried to get in on him. He was not having that. Uh-uh, says Krim. Shuts down the Look left window that. and then the right. 5-2. Complexity one round away from going up 2-0 here in our best of five in the winner's bracket finals. 
It's do or die time for Impact. What can they do? One round away from losing this game. They're going to give the bomb to Mr. Miracles, and the first pick was scored by the bomb carrier nice. with a big snipe. Yeah, huge. Miracles, you know, he's got to help out, continue contributing to this team. Killa also needs to make sure he stays alive. He's such a valuable player. He needs to start playing smarter and not so aggressive. Although it is his play style, there's a difference between playing stupidly and playing smart and aggressive, and he needs to scale back to that. So 4v3 situation in favor of Impact is exactly where they need to find themselves right now. Looks like they might be able to get this bomb down at B. They're really well set up. Up in the terminal pocket and you actually just saw on the mini map karma shot just to give away their position they're trying trying to draw someone into the terminal karma has a player directly to his right here's the battle he's got support from the left as well miracles in the middle with that bomb can plant it at b and i think he's doing so at this time, as Parasite was able to clean up Clayster, all up to Crim6 and TP from Complexity this now. This round has been beautifully played by Impact. Everything they've done to execute it, getting into that bead bomb site, the way they set up, trying to draw people out as well. Nice setup. It's going to be incredibly hard for Complexity to break it. Parasite takes out TP. Crim6 all alone, and Kill is going to clean him up. So I, Icon's Impact really making a smart play there. A huge round for them. Staying alive in this search and destroy, not allowing complexity to close it out. They're not done yet here on Express. Killa with some solid MSMC shots is going to clean out that round. 5-3 is the score. Impact needs to win three more in a row. Karma pulling out the shoddy here for his team. We're going to see him rush straight to the control tower. I know. that's uh, I love it, man. So let's see what he's able to do. Karma is 7-6. and six, So him and Killa, both with seven kills on the board, have been contributing to this team in a oh, big way. No. And, and that was, yeah, Killa kind of just stopped him there. Clayster picks the first blood up, taking out Parasite. 4v3 situation early on with the Parasite out of it. It's going to be difficult for this team. However, they are still on the defensive side of things, making it a little bit easier. But Clayster takes out Miracles. And now the task is getting even harder as Complexity is only two kills away. Make it one, but close this one out. Karma's got to do it all alone. Frantically firing shots, takes out Aches, and he's got to become a hero here if he's going to take out Clayster, Crim6, and TP by himself. Karma has some of the best wall banks in the game. He's got hit markers on two players, and he will just be swarmed by Complexity. They are now up two games to zero. One game away from our championship match in Anaheim, and Crim6 got the final kill. That's going to put him in double digits for game number two. What a round of SND from a top five player. I can't even believe the fact there's a, even a possibility that Impact now can be swept. 11 and three, 6 three, from Crim6. Yeah, 11 and 6. 8 and 7 on the other side. Karma still managing to go positive, but Impact, man, two kill or two games to cr Complexity cr in yeah, the first two games? So crazy. Baffled. And you know, Crim6 just likes killing stuff, so it works for him, you know? All right, TP start off hot. And that was the difference for Complexity. That man right there was the hero in game number two. Who's going to step up? Will it be another Complexity member? Or is it going to be someone from Impact?